Creo Parametric 7.0 supports the multi-body design also for drawings. First, when editing cross-hatching patterns in drawings, you can modify the properties of each body independently. Once activating the cross-hatching editor in X body mode, the selected body hatch section will be highlighted in graphics, so you can easily navigate between the bodies and understand which one is being modified. In the case that you want to copy the hatch properties from one body or component to the other, you can click the Copy Hatch option, select the hatch that you are copying from, and its properties will be applied to the hatch of the body or the component that you are modifying. Another area that was enhanced in order to support multi-body design is the repeat region tables in drawings. We have added new report symbols that can help you list the bodies that comprise your model, add information about their materials, and also show their parameters and units. In this example, I'm adding information for the predefined mass parameter that I created for each one of the model bodies. In some cases, you might also want to see an entry for the part itself and get a quick summary in one place for all the different materials that are assigned to your model. You can do this by changing the repeat region attributes to be recursive and get this result for the new PTC reported material report symbol. In this example, the model has two bodies with different materials assigned to them. So by default, the part entry for PTC reported material will be showing multi-material string. If you prefer to actually list all the unique materials in your model or show an empty cell, you can do so by defining the new detail option PTC reported material in region. And finally, we have also added several out-of-the-box table templates to help you list the body-related information of your design. 